Hey everyone, thanks for staying up late with us. Of course, college football returning to the Tennessee Valley this evening with the UNA Lions. They hit the field for the first time this season under the lights of Brawley Stadium. Now, of course, UNA taking on Western Illinois tonight in the shows. This was a pretty defensive game from the start. Lions on the punt. Marquis Smith back to field it. Smith is met by a pack of Lions, and guess what? He fumbles, and uh, Jacob Cummings comes through with the fumble recovery, and this was huge for the Lions because it set them up for their first touchdown of the season by none other than the quarterback, Christian Lopez, number six, going in for six. Extra point was no good, so it's only six to nothing. Let's fast forward now to the second quarter. UNA up nine to nothing. Deontes Thompson runs it in from nine yards out, cutting the UNA lead down to two. Now, Coach Willis was not happy about that situation, but UNA really quick to answer, though. Their very next drive is Lopez finding his man, Cortez Hall, and Hall knows how to put on the Jets. 75 yards later, he's in the end zone for a score. Lions now up 16 to 7. Let's go to two minutes to go left in the first half. Lions are back to punt. However, things were not great on special teams once again as the punt will be blocked and the Leathernecks, they will recover it out the back of the end zone. Lions only lead by two. Two seconds to go in the first half. Here comes G uh, Joe Gurley nailing a 42-yard field goal for UNA and the Lions grabbing their first win of the season by a final score of 26 to 17. To get off to a good start is big considering who we got coming up throughout the season. I, we understand we're playing some big time programs and you know wins are not going to come easy and it's going to be tough but we're just got to take one at a time. I'm just proud of these guys.